Let's do it. Lockout bingo number two of the day. Do 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 do. Three, two, one. Go fast, I will try. Um, it's first to 13, but also we're going to be clearing the whole board. I think I'm going to save and quit Sank after these two drop downs. Instead of going from Link's house. I think I'm just going to not do the chess games, and we'll just beeline the drop-downs. Mario is interesting. I'll go play. I'll go play the top chess game. I uh, maybe I just don't. Oh God. <laughs> Three drop downs. I'm gonna bail on this. <clears throat> yes, it is technically a different drop down because you are. Appearing somewhere new. Oh, he already did the four drop downs. Oh, shit. Interesting. How? I'm trying to think what. Maybe you do uncle or something? Uh oh. I guess if you don't. Yeah, I don't know. Use the same one twice and count as two? Yes. It was deemed allowed by the people who make the rules. Alright, let's just beeline to chess game then, I guess. This is kind of spooky. Heart piece. Snag a map, that's one. That's there. If we get a bottle with a... If we get a bottle, I can do that, which is right there. I have no bombs. <clears throat> I can buy bombs for my one thing from a shop. I 
Unless you're just like not grabbing Houlihan money, maybe, and then beelining to Uncle. Um, and then doing one of the the CAC drop downs. It's the only way I could see you doing getting the four drop downs that quickly. Okay. Also desert and eastern. That's a compass. Or a glove from Dark World Access. glove so I can't lift up a uh, light world rock yet if I get a 300 or just a bunch of general money I could go buy Zora snag this just because it's quick and a guaranteed heart piece I guess uh, let's see what the crab drops actually greens <laughs> ouch I have a fire rod no magic and I have a hammer small of course god dumb video game compass number two I got no money. do this first since I have no intention of going to Zora areas three compasses
Heart container. That could be worth, potentially. Depending upon our item sets. I think I do Hyrule Castle here. I have what, Agina, Hyrule Castle, Eastern, and Sahasrila. That kind of blows. That's okay. Alright. Um, where's my lift up a glove? That's also Dark World access. I could go straight to Pod. And bomb a floor. But that's also kind of slow. Ah, oh, there's that. Ooh, okay. Well, one big thing with that is I can go immediately find out what, um... What the red crystals are. Since those dungeons are important. If it was a four-way free-for-all, you would guarantee just, like, beeline any goal that you had access to. Uh, 700 rupees washed up, Mimir. I could also pay pay the three hints right now as well. Buy Red Shield or Zora. Okay. No way to know which one that was. Okay, fourth map. So I need one map or two compasses. Do enchiladas, nice. We're doing huge left overnight tonight. Uh, it's not eight, it's seven per. The last upgrade is always worth ten. I also want to buy something from a Dark World shop. Uh, so let's go snag that real quick.
Hello, sir. May I please have a shield? I should have bought the bombs. Uh, no. It does not. Skull and Swamp. Interesting. Yeah, the square says no potion shop, bomb shop, or uh, upgrade fairy. Alright, uh, that also kind of tells... I feel like, unless he forgot to mark it, which is possible... Um, Buying the red shield does count as a Dark World shop item as well, so he probably bought Zora. I'm gonna play this twice just for money. prep for uh, aero capacity or bomb capacity so nice bomb and arrow count really can't beat any dungeons right now. I really want to pod small before I go in there. <laughs> um, okay, we can knock this out real quick. Uh, where's the hints? Pay for health or hints from three things. Ten rupees. This is a proper tourney. It is a proper tourney. As in, it is an actual tournament. What did he just get? Oh, he just did it. Okay, cool. So we're in the same area right now. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, every tourney is a proper tourney. Uh, there's no challenge. <laughs> it is, uh... They, um... They only wanted groups of four, so they didn't do challenge just to... So that, like, you know... Sign-ups were easier to handle. Uh, I can make a command with the uh, with the groups and stuff. Uh, after, I'm still missing one map. There's my pod small. Cool. <sighs> okay, eleven hearts or red mail. Is close. That's there. Ice rod and boomerang. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a pain in the ass to de to death warp here. <clears throat> and 
and the bingo board is the same for all the group matches, and the group matches also play to complete the board. Um, where the brackets will have some extra goals, so the boards won't be the same every single time. Um, and those are just first to 13. Tiebreaker doesn't matter. I would really like one more pod small. Honestly. What's up, homewrecker? Yeah, challenge functionality is relatively limited for the most part. So, like, being able to keep track of number of squares and stuff is easier to done on some sort of spreadsheet. It's really hoping that was another pod key. So now I can get the pod big chest while I'm in there and probably not ever go back. Uh. If I happen to get a sword in here, I probably beat Skull Woods instead. Fuck. There's my map. I could save this small key and do the drop down instead, but the likelihood that I'll find one Skullwood small is very high. Ooh, that's huge. So now I want to go uh, bomb drop down. <sighs> Where? There it is. That one. That's next. I haven't done Sahasrila or Eastern at all yet. Eastern is a big chest that I can do. Um... So I don't need to mark my Jesus, my compasses anymore. So it'll be one big chest done. Since I'm going to the back, I can uh, grab a ton of my money for my capacity upgrades. And then ideally, I just fill that out on my way to ice. So I can do tongue. If I have mirror, I can do the tongue goal and then capacity. If I don't have the mirror, I can do capacity and then the, the tongue goal. Um, that needs mitts. Uh, I'm just going to go straight to this. Uh, the zero in parentheses is number of bingos, but that's irrelevant for um, this tournament. Uh, I won the race against Vix earlier. All right, there's my mirror. Okay, 
Very nice. Okay, so I can do the Light World and Dark World rocks now. Um, I can do both Lift Up rocks and Ice Rod area. Um, very easily now. Okay. Uh, first to 13 technically wins. Um, since once you get 13, you cannot be beaten. Uh, but we will, we'll be playing the whole boards for the group stage matches for tiebreakers for seating in brackets. All right, so everything back here is blocked by two smalls. So I feel pretty good about getting anything here. There's Turtle Rock big. It's good. Um, ooh, the book. Okay. Um, interesting. Huh. Yeah, book is one of the... Book and killing... Well, Dead Rock and Red Igor being combined makes that goal less bad. Um, but yeah, book book is a huge worry. Um, in terms of, like, how long the, the seed is going to take. actually gonna run back out and just I'm just gonna go swim I'm gonna bail on pyramid um, since we got the flippers I probably would have done pyramid first if I had to fake flipper but since I don't have to ow dude come on Forgot about that one, actually. All right, reveal a hidden cave is right there. Get away! Uh. Open desert, right there. <clears throat> I have a desert small key as well, so we can snag that and roots. Okay. 
Okay, I can go drink my goo. In the tavern. And then head up the mountain after that, I guess. Ideally, we get flute here. So I have multiple reasons to go. Okay, lamp is gross, but good. <clears throat> yeah, Barman is such a good soundtrack. <laughs> Don't need any more maps. Eh. Barman here is a really good game. Uh, I'll do a Gina, I guess, since I'm over here. If I don't do it now, I'm never going to do it, so. What's up, Najimi? Quake is good. Alright, so what? I need Hookshot and Swamp Small. And a sword to get the Throw Bottle into Pyramid Fairy. Uh, cannot kill a Dead Rock or an Igor yet. Um, okay, that's right there. I didn't clear the fucking Tile Room in Desert, dude. What am I doing? I almost drank this. Instead of playing a flute. <laughs> that would have been bad. Alright, up the mountain time. I have Cave 45 and Graveyard Ledge too, which kind of suck. Which dungeon have cracked floors? Um, you have Pod, Thieves Town, Ice Palace. Um, did I make a note of that? Uh, and Ganon's Tower. But Ganon's Tower is locked by seven crystals, so. Um, pod, pod one is available instantaneously. Ice, you need mitts and to be able to get to freeze or room. Uh, Thieves Town, you need the big key to get to the back. So pod is the most likely one, unless you happen to have GT or Thieves Town big key. Ooh, we got a hook shot. <clears throat> no bug net, right? No. If this was entrance shuffle, more likely that GT could be your first one. But without entrance shuffle, that's basically impossible. Since the pod one is available just from Dark World Access. Alright, we need two swords. Oh yeah, there's one at the at the front of ice, you're right. I really wanted to wait until mitts for this, but
<coughs> Defeated Dead Rock or Red Igor. Cool. Big. Alright, so most likely I can get into Mire once I get a sword and the flutes. That's 10 hearts, so I need one more heart. Hmm. He also maxed out bomber arrow capacity, so I don't need to worry about that anymore. Uh, actually, let's go get the heart container on Hylia. I have the back of escape to do as well, so I might save and quit from here and do that. I should have... Uh, I guess I wasn't that close. I don't know. I probably should have grabbed this when I did the two lift up rocks. No, wrong place. <sighs> uh, always the same 25 in groups. <clears throat> uh, there are more in brackets. So this will be big chest number two. Uh, I'll mark it once I enter Eastern. That's the once I enter Eastern, I'm guaranteed to get the big chest. But if Sahashal is something different, I might not. Like mitts. <laughs> um. Opponent having hook shot is also kind of scary. No, the order doesn't matter. Okay, Desert's the green. Another pod small is actually kind of scary. Okay. <clears throat> so I can actually beat pod. That'll give me a Dark World dungeon and a crystal. Doesn't really matter what order I do these in. <sighs> this is also a crystal, so this will get me two crystals. A sword gets me a third. A number of things get me a third crystal. That probably gets me a third crystal. Uh, 
Oh, that's my uh, row as well with the bow. Okay, this is now going to be too... The one thing with Thieves Town is I can't beat it and get the big chest currently. Um... So I could opt to not beat Thieves Town and only open the big chests. I know it's not a good crystal, so I don't necessarily need to beat the Thieves Town boss. Uh, big thing I'm still missing is mitts and hook shots. Okay, there's my Skullwood small, so I can beat the dungeon when I get a sword. <laughs> I need two swords for the break tablet goal. I need access to Mire or Turtle Rock, which I could, once I get a sword I can and mitts, I can get into Turtle Rock, potentially. Um, mitts also get me the Tongue Statue. Let's get me follower to catfish. Okay. So I can full clear pod. I'd assume he probably got that bow and killed a red Igor instead of a dead rock. Yo, Dewey with a 61 months. Oh. You cannot use Quake without a sword now. And the Dead Rock or Igor square is the same. So, like, I can't get that anymore. No matter what. Ice Big is another big chest once we get entrance. I have a lot of big keys already. Uh, no, those don't burn. The only the only floating skulls that burn are in Mire and Turtle Rock. You can't Bombos or Fire Rod, the skulls that spawn in Pod and Eastern. Before I did one of the bingo races, that's one of the things that I checked. Crystals. Cool. I imagine he did pod. Um, well, I might not beat this crystal then. I am running out of things to do.
I guess I'm doing this for Dark World Dungeons, but I'm probably behind on that too. Uh, favorite MSU? Um, I don't know, there's so many good ones out there. Tunic is probably my most used. Fuck, alright, I'm not doing that shit. <laughs> um... Uh, let's go to Pyramid. <clears throat> but just having the, the variety is, like, way better than <clears throat> just having, like, the, your, your favorite pack, you know? Like, being able to just use whatever you want. where this is gross um i might just go to catfish because i really i'm just running out of options Yeah, mitts are locking a lot currently. I can buy Zora item here and Zora ledge. Okay, that's a tile room, so that, that kind of saves my ass from, uh... <clears throat> from, uh, skipping the desert, um, tile room. Yeah, follower to cap. Well, it doesn't need mitts. It's just very likely that it'll be mitts instead. Kiki will not leave pot area, you know. Uh, so you could do Big Bomb if you get Crystals 5 and 6. Uh, Smith is the most likely one, and you can also do Old Man if you A, don't save Old Man, uh, and then have, like, Hammer, Hammer Glove, Pearl, and Flute. You can flute off of the mountain with Old Man. Uh, purple chest opener doesn't follow you all the way there. I think he stops following you once you throw his sign. Does that sound right? But yeah, also, I don't think that guy follows you to uh, the Dark Worlds at all. Uh, tile room in both worlds.
Could also be like back of Skull Woods with the fire rod is progression. There's a lot of really gross locations for this uh, progression to be. First chest and swamp is available. That's what I'm really trying to get the swamp. Please, bro. <clears throat> I don't think I have the ability to do, ch to do Spike Cave yet, but I'm going to try. If I had a goo, I could. Oh, I got it with the bomb tech. <laughs> That's cool. I'm gonna do K45 into just chest one swamp. We get Swamp Big Chest and a good crystal. <sighs> if we get two swords, I can do Bombos Tablet. And one sword gets me the Pyramid Fairy goal. Okay, I want health here because Argus with no sword is pretty spooky.
I'm gonna do the back first, and then I'll do uh, left side after. If uh, I get literally nothing from here. My stuff. I'm kind of hoping mitts are just like in the back of Thieves Town somewhere because that takes Nux. Uh, far away. Um, from uh, Swamp Small Vanilla. What's up, Jarvis? Oh my god, grab it! Never heard of streamer cleaner, so who knows? <laughs> All right, I got to go back in for left side. Yeah, bingo is definitely like bingo isn't uncommon in Link to the Past Rando, uh, but Lockout hasn't really been done in a competitive setting before. I think most bingo for A Link to the Past has been... Um, been Blackout. Another popular speedrunning-esque bingo is uh, Mario 64 does triple bingo, which I think could be interesting. Um, for Link to the Past, but this tournament is doing Blackout. Or not Blackout, Lockout, excuse me. English is hard. Am I winning? Uh, it's pretty close. mopping. <clears throat> Man, I could also do three Dark World dungeons, but me bailing on pod really fucking blows. Ooh, okay. So, you're gonna get shoehorned into this at some point. Holy mother of god. <laughs> I'm going straight to ice. It was also vanilla swamp small key. <laughs> so, you 100% get shoehorned into going into swamp at some point. I feel like I might have been the first one there. I still had a decent amount of things left. Uh, where's Tongue Statue? Right there. I 
I can probably burn a skull. Do I do Master Sword races? I haven't done a Master Sword race since like 2013. Maybe 2014. Seems like I'm overdue. Nah. <laughs> Ooh, there's the three Dark World dungeons. So, pro okay, he probably just beat Swamp, if I had to guess. I need, what, one more sword for go mode, most likely? Unless Turtle Rock is Bombos. Yeah, Master Sword just sucks. If I was going to speedrun this game, I'm doing... <clears throat> That's big chest number four. Um... Um... If I'm going to speedrun this game, I'm going to do full game NMG or a glitch category. <laughs> I will probably never do a Master Sword run ever again. But I don't really speed run this game very often at all anymore. Okay, bring a follower to... I, this is the wrong direction. What are we 1v1ing in? Hundo Fundo. Oh, Master Sword? This was the last time you did a Master Sword run. <laughs> All right, I gotta really hope I don't get sniped here. So I can do Turtle Rock Big Chest and Desert Big Chest for six. I think I'm going to bail on Pyramid Fairy, because that involves beating Skull Woods and then doing a whole bunch of other shit. I need to turn this guy in first. Um, so I think I'm not going to do that. He has three Darkwell Dungeons done. It's very likely... Uh, he probably has. Well, I don't. I don't know where this other sword is, so I don't know how he would have beaten Skullwoods without this one sword. Uh, Catfish was already done. I got super walled by not having mitts, so I checked Catfish when I did Pyramid. Um, I'm, I'm probably just gonna go straight to Turtle Rock. I also can't catch a fairy yet.
That's not a hook shot. Ooh, he got burn a floating Stalfo skull. Um Okay. Then I am gonna go to Skull Woods. Huh. Alright. <clears throat> Interesting. If he burned his floating Stalfo skull, he has to have myths. Why put off Pyramid Fairy? I mean, Turtle Rock has the tile room in both worlds, too. So, I really should have just gone to Turtle Rock, to be honest. But it's too late now. Eh. Maybe he'll forget about Turtle Rock tile room. <laughs> I feel like if he burned his skull... I don't know, dude. Tile runes are long. I don't know how long they are. I don't have skull big, right? No. But yeah, if I choose not to beat Thieves Town and just open the big chests, that'll be my sixth big chest after Turtle Rock. Admits to burn a skull. And there's a tile room in Meyer too, so. It really doesn't. So this is next. Where are those skulls in Meyer and Turtle Rock? Meyer tile room is on path. Turtle Rock isn't. Huh? They're both one room away from the tile rooms. Unless he doesn't know about Turtle Rock Tile Room, which would be unlikely, but possible. Well, if he burned a floating skull, he can get into Mire or Turtle Rock. That is a guarantee. Eastern and Pod skull floating skulls do not burn. All right. Well, I'm going to Turtle Rock because I'm just opening big chests and doing the tile. I'm going to do the tile room first because that gets me a goal. Maybe he didn't do a desert tile room and never found the Harris Mall. It's possible. Okay, so yeah, Master Sword is 
Master Sword is like go mode for the whole board. Um, I'd be extremely surprised if I can't get in here right now. Yes, they're set on seed generation. All right, we're just going straight to the tile room and then straight to the big chest. Fuck! Uh oh. I okay. So Thieves Town, Thieves Town, big chest. Uh, is my huge in the bag because you need. If you've already beaten Thieves Town, you need the Thieves Town small key. Monka S. Where's my fire rod? I think that's faster than Thieves Town, so. I need to stop getting these stupid open, <laughs> open seeds for bingos. Open minus the the mitts lock, I guess. Monka, monka, monka. All right, I didn't lose. We did it. <laughs> now I just need a fucking sword. Um, yeah, lockout bingo's crazy sweaty. Yeah, that's game, but um. Uh, group stages are doing full boards for tie breaks. I don't even have a... I don't... <laughs> I... Didn't open anything in Turtle Rock except for Big Chest. Um... There, there is a... Com there's literally a command for it. It says in the lockout command. Uh, yeah, they'll change in the playoffs, but for groups, it is the same 25 tiles. 
Dude, I don't know what I'm doing. The sassy title command? That's been gone for years. <laughs> That's been gone since Nate uh, reprogrammed the bot and had it have Twitch integration. It hasn't been literal years, but it's been like probably a year. <clears throat> Yo, I'm fucking doing it! I don't give a shit! <laughs> Give me that Master Zord! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Man, I could have done so much in Turtle Rock. Me, me just... <laughs> Ignoring Turtle Rock to do big chests, and then basically, uh... No, nah, these are not randomized. Uh, the, the mode that we're playing under is Fad Keys with starting boots. Fad Keys has GT Big Keys always in GT Basement somewhere, and Castle Tower Keys are vanilla. How did I plan to open the Thieves' Town big chest? Uh, you just don't beat the dungeon, the lantern. You steal the small key, don't go up to the attic, and go open the big chest. Uh, I found a sword on Lumberjack, HP. And so, yeah, like, if Thieves Town isn't a good crystal, and, like, the three Dark World dungeons and the three crystals goal is already done, there's zero reason to beat Thieves Town. Logically, you can't beat it without the small key anyways. So, if it doesn't fall under any of those categories of need, there's no reason to not open the big chest. Uh, Mr. Sandwich gifting a sub to HB. Welcome to Puck Farm. HB, hope you enjoy those emotes. Alright, I got a mirror.
It's either tablet, right? Yeah. All right, let's go. Come on. What is the name of this MP? 